Hi, it's Jamie from E-Models, and here we have our design skins for the Phantom. Um, made out of a nice quality vinyl, which has been die cut to our specification. In this case, a very nice torn carbon fibre, which we have specifically ha uh, designed to fit onto the Phantom shell itself. The Phantom's a very mean machine, and we've made it more aggressive by having a few tears and cuts. Yes. So basically what we need to do is stick these skins onto the Phantom. As Jamie said they've been professionally um, die, cut. die cut. Now applying them the what you need to first make sure is you've got the Phantom the right way round so obviously you can see the the two stickers there and there which go towards the nose which are to the front of the Phantom so I will apply the the stickers so here we go Nice. Just try and grab it without the DC. So with the DC, a DC. Right. Right then. So if we stick it there. The stickers actually go on very, very easy. What we need to try and do is eliminate any potential air bubbles. This goes on very nice, that does. Oh, bit of a bit of the crease. Get rid of the crease. As you can see, it's very nice. Very nice indeed. Okay, so. One section. Back to the front. Let's do this one. The best thing to do really is start in the corner. Right in the corner there. Remember the last thing you want is any air bubbles. But to be honest, the way the uh, so the way it's been designed. It goes down very, very, very easy. And then once the adhesive goes hard, it's not coming off. That's nice, that does. We're going to be selling these online. We've had quite a lot of customers who have bought these already. Now, how nice is that? Very nice indeed. One's going on nicely. Okay, so again, what direction am I in? Yeah, so that's the nose. Yeah, I'm in the right direction, so let's get this one. Again, you have to be a little bit careful when taking the stickers off. Again, back in the centre, like, like so, and just slowly. If you do make this a mistake, the uh, the stickers are very, very tough, so you've got nothing to worry about there. Yeah, let's lift that one up. This is very nice. So in that case, I need to lift that one up. In fact, let's bring it around a little bit more. Um, go. Ah, oh, that's better. Bring that down there like so. Perfect. That one down there, like so. Fantastic. Remember, we don't want any air bubbles or any creases. Any creases. Like them. Like them. Look at that, very nice indeed. Beautiful. Mm. Okay. Honestly, these just go on so, so easy. And once you've done the first one, it just gets easier. The great thing is, as well, if you actually look at the Phantom, there is um, lines on top. 
which are exactly the same yeah, shape as these lines and there's some little in here little grooves so they are they are great just to get on perfect there we go and we'll put these on what we can do here is just go underneath like so a little bit of space between the sticker you can see with the grooves it's 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 very very self-explanatory when yeah again stick it on there don't want to go the right way around so I stick it on there like so down like that Very nice, indeed. This can go on the controller, but uh, well, actually, it goes that way around. It goes like so. But uh, the customer he doesn't want it well, on, doesn't want it on the controller. He just wants it on the actual uh, phantom. And then we've also got the little e mm. nice small e models. Yeah. He's a big fan of E-Models, so we'll put a uh, E-Models sticker <laughs> on his controller for him. So there we go, the, uh, the DJ Phantom Carbon Rough Effect. I think that looks absolutely fantastic. That's brilliant. And these should start be rolling out of our site on eBay not so long now. Yeah, that's... Uh, yeah. The difference that's made. Beautiful.